Admirals, happy Monday. And we're going to take the opportunity to have both of you here to talk about people. You've both been out on the waterfront a good bit talking to sailors and their families about issues close to their heart. But we're also talking a lot about what we need to build tomorrow's Navy, force structures, ship count, uh, the FY16 budget. So Admiral Greenard, I wanted to get your take on um, on your approach to people. Do we need mm -hmm. to take the same long-term view, or are people more of a here and now issue? Uh, it's both, you know. Isn't that the easy way out? <laughs> no, but it really is both. People are our asymmetric advantage, but we have to, we ask them to do so much. They are so flexible. They adapt so quickly. We have to take care of them in the here and now. And what I mean by that is gaps at sea, a decent promotion opportunity, uh, get uh, deployments uh, under you know control. Give them predictability, compensation. That's the here and now. Uniforms, mm. but also there's a more important aspect, and it's becoming ever more clear. And Bill said that very clearly to me. We need to look into the future. What are we going to look like in five years, in mm. ten years? Does the Navy Personnel Command have the database to handle that? Are we going to be able to challenge them? And as he says, are we going to be able to manage that talent out there? That's incredibly important, and so we need to do both. Uh, we have been so used to just having folks taking them now, but we're going to have a very different challenge in the future. Yeah.